MustangMedic.com. We show you everything from point A to point B, day one to day soul. So enjoy and thanks for watching. We work on, buy, sell, restore, Mustang and most of all, love your Mustang. MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration out of restoration. Mustangs of the Queen Mary 2012. Excellent car show, guys. Check it out. I got to do that. Yeah. All right, so there's Mustang Country. Elite Restorations. Got the rotisserie. And Carlos is really wanting that rotisserie, man. We got to get one of these. This is something that is on our list of things to do big time. But this is called a rotisserie. And, and Carlos was like, what's a rotisserie? What's a rotisserie? This is a rotisserie. So basically, you take the entire body, strip it clean of all the parts. Oh, there you go. Sarah's modeling. Very nice. And you can rotate the car, and Carlos can macho, macho wire wheel on its sides. So this is, uh, this is sweet. This is a little fastback right here. Uh, 67. I want to say 67, right? Chris? 67. See, I'm getting better. You see all the metal work right here, but literally this bottom side that you always see us crawling around on can be sideways and we can just be sitting there working at our leisure. So that is what is called a rotisserie and this is definitely slated for us in one of our future projects. So I'm going to find out where Danny picked up his. Let's go see Danny. Danny's over there with his hat. Elite Restoration in Paramount. You can reach them. They do a lot of Mustangs. Uh, 562 Zero eight one nine nine nine, and there's Danny standing over there with Freddie. All right, Danny, I just put your phone number up there, phone number up there, and I was checking out your rotisserie, man. I got a little, I'm a little jealous right now. What's a rotisserie cost, man? What is a rotisserie? That machine. That machine. Thousand dollars? That's not bad. Carlos, look at Carlos. Carlos is get over here, Carlos. What are you standing over there back there? One that's not powder coated. This, you want powder coating, it's another six hundred. This is this is oh, okay, we don't need the powder coating, no. man. We don't have to go fancy. But Carlos has like been our wire wheel man underneath the cars. We've done like three undersides right now. So we are looking at this rotisserie and we're like, we have to have it. But there's Danny, Elite Restoration. He's been doing he's been getting more and more into the Mustangs lately, so you guys can check him out. He, he does, as you can see, does full restorations like we do, and uh, he's got a lot, a lot of experience in the, in the collision uh, field. And uh, he's got that's your red one, isn't it? Yes. Here's his red Mustang. Let's go take a peek at that. See you, Danny. And there's Freddie being all stoic and cool. Do you have anything you want to say, Danny? Freddie? No, I didn't think so. <laughs> this is Danny's car. He actually restored this car, and this thing is a beauty. I mean, '66 GT. And there's uh, he's got a little photo board in front. It was uh, purchased and uh, used in '67, driven for 10 years before it was retired to a garage. Restoration began in 2010 and was completed on June 11th, uh, 2011. And look at this car. I mean, it is just—it's nicer than Ford would have come out with it. I mean, it's just been every detail's been handled. Right there, and look at the interior too. It's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. It's in the details, guys. It's in the details. And uh, we appreciate anybody that cares about a Mustang as much as this guy is, as, as much as we do and as much as he does. So he also, there's a good chance that he might be doing the 71 paint job. We're going to see how that works out. But uh, time will tell with all these. And look at this, oops, excuse me, sir. This is, look at this gorgeous fastback right here. Tim, I'm looking for you. I might actually have one on Thursday um, or Wednesday. I might be going to look at a 67 uh, fastback for you. And then there's just Mustangs everywhere. This is, this is gonna be a lot of video. I hope I don't fill up my phone and make this a shorter video. Oh, sorry guys, pleasure regions. So we'd like you to give another big round of applause for anybody that was just saluting for the service. Woo! Come on, louder than that. Give your louder applause. Yeah! Woo! Okay. One last thing. One last thing. 
And this is really important. I sent this out in an email late last night. Most of you probably didn't get it. Who was getting these crazy updates that I sent out in the middle of the night? Do you feel fully prepared for the SCAR show now? Yeah. Sure you do. Last night I put out an email. Uh, uh, everything's set to go. Uh, I was sitting here last night with my wife looking around, thinking, you know, I came up with this crazy idea, and all these people are making it happen. And last night, more than ever before, I just can't even tell you how much I appreciate my volunteers and the sh people that make yeah. this show happen. I don't do any of the heavy lifting. I can't. So I want you to give a big round of applause for our volunteers. Yeah. Louder, because they've been here for three days. At some point during the day, I don't want to hear how great the show is. I want you to find a volunteer, somebody in a parking vest, somebody in a club booth, the raffle booth, uh, the apparel booth. Uh, thank a volunteer today if you have a good time, okay? <laughs> thank you very much for being at our driver's meeting, our shortest one yet. And uh, go out and vote, have a good time, see our vendors, and uh, it's just going to be a beautiful day. MustangMedic.com Please look for the link in the description below for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon. Mustangmedic.com